If you're new to poker and want to get better, this is the video for you. Alright guys, what's up, how's it going? My name is Rick and I'm one of the founders of Easy Poker. Now, when I first started out playing poker, I found most tutorials to be overly complicated and way too long. So I thought I'd share some of my knowledge with you guys in some easy to understand videos. If you enjoy this video, please take a second to like and maybe subscribe. It really helps our channel. Alright guys, let's get into it. Here are 5 tips to get good at poker. Tip number 1 is to play a lot of poker. This may sound basic and it is, but there's no way around it. Too many new players jump headfirst into books and blogs, but the way you truly learn the game is by playing a lot. When you're first starting out, I definitely recommend just playing for fun. You need that sandbox environment where you can experiment and make the wrong decisions without losing all your savings. Try to play people your own level or just above you. Running down to the local casino and getting absolutely schooled by more experienced players won't do you much good. In fact, it'll probably just discourage you. You can of course ask great players for advice, but stick to playing people your own level. Tip number two is to know the basics of poker strategy. A fast and easy way to get better at poker is to just spend some time scratching the surface of poker strategy. It doesn't have to be a deep dive, in fact it probably shouldn't. But having just a loose understanding of the most basic poker strategies will open up your game a lot and help you experiment. And that's why I've made a complete playlist that introduces things like position, bluffing and bidding in less than 30 minutes. Knowing just the basics of poker strategy will instantly set you apart from beginners and take you to the next level of poker player. Tip number 3 is to not overcomplicate things. Yes, you should definitely familiarize yourself with the basic rules and strategies of poker. But you really only need to scratch the surface. A lot of new beginners go out and buy 5 heavy books and watch every poker movie in existence or spend hours looking at spreadsheets and ranges that they have no idea how to read. Remember, poker is easy to learn but hard to master. You need to walk before you can run and that's okay. If one day you find out that you like to ride your bike, you don't go out and buy thousands of dollars worth of gear the next day. You just grab the bike and roll off the curb. Same thing applies here. By all means, if you want to do a deep dive into poker strategy, you can, but it's not necessary to get started with poker. Tip number 4 is to keep your opponents in mind. Remember, you're playing poker, not solitaire. This means that you have opponents to consider. Way too often I see new players completely focused on just their own cards. They'll be looking at the hand and looking at the flop and then looking back at their hand. But you need to look up and around. What story are your opponents telling you? How can their actions give you clues about the cards they're holding? When you get a good read on your opponents, things like bluffing and betting gets a lot easier. So look up, they might be telling you exactly what you need to know. Tip number 5 is to do it for the fun of it. Before that though, let me just say that this video is brought to you by us, the Easy Poker app. The easiest way to play poker with friends, whether you're sitting together or playing online from separate locations. No chips or playing cards needed. Get started now, it's completely free and you'll find the link down below. Alright now, if you want to get good at poker, you have to do it for the fun of it. Some people get into poker because they want to make money or because they like to gamble or because they want to be famous poker players. And while all of that is certainly achievable through poker, let me assure you, those who get to that level are in it for the love of the game. It's going to be a long grind, so you have to enjoy the journey. Alright guys, that's it. My tips to get good at poker. I hope you enjoyed this video and if you did, please like and subscribe. It really does make a difference for us. If you have additional tips or questions, please let me know in the comments below. Thank you and enjoy the rest of your day.